Hello again. We are here at El Padel in Tampere. Amazing club, eight courts, sauna, beautiful place. Anyway, we are gonna give you a nice drill. It's more like a rally. Where is one up, one back. The person at the net is working on aiming and control to one of the shots that we consider the best, which is cross court, but in a leg. In this case, because I'm on this corner, I want Rika to aim constantly for my right leg in order to make me move away to defend inside out and open a big gap in the middle for the next shot that they play. Or even better, sometimes that ball is gonna come so sharp that I probably gonna have to do a conversion, which in the old fashioned world is known as spinning. The conversion will be a forehand when I'm trying to go inside out, but then I see that ball, I don't have time. So then I'm gonna spin, which is a fantastic achievement from Rika if she makes me spin. So it looks easier than it is. For me, again, I'm not trying to angle the player. I'm not trying to finish the point. I'm trying to be okay getting attacked and defending many times this same ball, either inside out forehand, yes, by pivoting well, bam, or sometimes pivoting and realizing that the ball is already behind me. So I'm gonna convert into a backhand and then keep defending. So let's see how that goes. <sighs> Pivot, pivot, ah, spin. Rika, fantastic work. Why we teach playing a lot to the inner leg or middle? Because your ball, as you saw, forces me to go away. So then remember, this is a team sport, yeah? At least when you are on court. So by you creating that big gap in the middle, you are doing a fantastic job moving me, yes? When sometimes people think that it's better to play in the corner. Be careful with that, because if you play in the corner without first moving me, be, 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 you know, before first creating a gap, I think it's a terrible choice. Because if I'm here and you play corner right away, I have the down the line option. You are pushing your partner away. Basically, you are telling to your partner, hey, move the fuck out, I'm gonna take 80% of the court. Yes, and as you get to play better players, what am I gonna be able to do from here if I'm skillful? I'm gonna be able to roll you. So to us, you build the point, inner legs, which is right leg here, left leg there, or middle. Now, once you find an opening in the corner, of course I want you to penetrate the player in the corner, but first, first we need to open that gap, because remember that most of the players that have a good position on court will guard this area. Yeah, that's why the position is similar to this line here, because they don't want to leave this open. Also because the middle, they can always share it, but the corner, no. So you got to protect the corner, yeah? And this is why when you're at the net, your job is to play middle, inner leg, to not open the court. And then when you are able to see a gap in the corner, of course I want you to use it. But build the point, inner leg, middle, and corner only when you have created that gap, when there is a chance to penetrate the player. Okay? Fantastic.